Stillwater. Can books and memories really be family? What do you think, Carl? I don't think so. They're not a real family, one with people. I'd be lonely with only books. Do you think Mr. Morgan is lonely, like Bjorn was, out there on the ice? If I were Mr. Morgan, I would be. I wonder what we could do for Mr. Morgan. We need to help him find his way back to shore, where he doesn't have to be alone. We could visit him more. And maybe make his place more cheerful for the holidays. His house is the only one without decorations. I know, we can get him a Christmas tree. Yes, a big gigantic one. I know just the place. How nice of you, Carl. I haven't seen Mr. Morgan in a while. How's he doing? Come see for yourself. Don't mind if I do. Hi, Mrs. Wilson. We're bringing some holiday cheer to Mr. Morgan. Do you have any extra decorations? Oh, sure. Thank you. Some friends. I can see that. We got you a tree and a wreath, and everyone came to help decorate. Well, it's a good thing I didn't eat all those tang yuan. <laughs> How about here? A little more to the left. Yeah, perfect. Looks like the alligator missed a few, eh, Carl? <laughs> <laughs> These are just the easy ones. Who knows how many are buried out there in the snow? I guess we'll find out in the spring. I think I've got it. Ooh. <gasps> Beautiful. I'm glad you like it. I can't remember when my house has had this much holiday cheer. All of you, Carl, Eddie, Michael, Stillwater. My neighbors and friends, you're my Northern Lights. Does that mean you found your way back to the shore? Back home to family? You know, I think I did. <laughs> 